new segment on the show, and I want to mm-hmm. get into it because it's the new hot segment hitting the streets, and everyone be loving it. All right. Mm-hmm. So it's time for the new segment that we cooked up. It's called Memory Lame. Where do these bizarre memories come from? That is so lame. So in English, if you say this is lame when you're describing something, uh, what you are saying is that it's not cool, it's not awesome, uh, it's not interesting. That's L A M E. As in lame, like not cool, like Jill. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Jill's great. Uh, this is where we review something from the 90s and decide if it was radical or if it sucks big a time. Uh, if you want to be part of the show, you can submit your memory lame suggestions to us on Twitter at Working Peapod. Okay, so uh, as it goes, the guests will always give their memory lame item first. So, uh, Jamey, if you could please provide us with your first memory lame item for us to vote, please. Mine is going to be the Skip It. Hey now kids, it's a brand new beat. A brand new toy you can wear on your feet. Skip It, Skip It. Do a good jump, do high pop. Skip It, Skip It. Skip it and a jump and a bop, do bop. But the very best thing of all, there's a counter on this ball. Maybe you can beat your very best score. Maybe you can jump a whole lot more. Skip oh, yeah. And I oh, loved it. Yeah. Yeah. I loved skip it. Wow. The mm-hmm. Skip It. Oh, yeah. man. Didn't, didn't it have a song? Didn't Skip It have oh, a song? We will play the song. Like a skip character. It. Mm-hmm. <laughs> skip It. Skip yeah, totally play the song. Over. Yeah. I'm going to, I'll cook up yeah. the song and, and I'll patch it in on this episode. Give the people a little Perfect. behind the scenes. Nice. A little Perfect. Skip It. Um, not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Uh, me and Skip It have a dark oh past. Yeah. Uh, it was my, uh, I have a, everyone knows by now that I have an older sister. People don't know this. My older sister was very, very mean <laughs> and uh, she was very, very brutal at times. And that Skip It was a weapon. All right. <laughs> you grab that thing and you start swinging it. <laughs> that shillelagh was taking out teeth, pal. It truly was that. a weapon. That's good. So, uh, it, it, it was, you, and you could use it on your hands or your feet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, it was tons of bruises. I'm gonna, I'm oh, gonna say that baby. I've never successfully used a skip it. I never, I never had the coordination or something. It just wasn't in my, it wasn't in my wheelhouse. I think my parents still have mine, Tom. So I'll just ship it to you, so you can try it mm, out as an adult it, and let us know it. how it goes. Yeah, the old skip that, it. That that would be that would be excellent. Yeah. I'd like to. Uh, maybe I'll get some video footage of me trying. <laughs> Honestly, I'll, I'll Amazon it today. Actually, <laughs> honestly, Jay, honestly, I'm not surprised if you do the skip it and that turns into the next workout mm. fad, and you have you have like the Peloton of skip it. Yeah, you know, yeah. and you're just like skip it now, double jump <laughs> now. Skip it. I think run. That you're, I think you that you're mixing this with a bop it. I was just thinking of a bop with the bop it. Yeah. Bop, I am mixing it with the bop That's a good it. One. Oh, so, well, we're not rating the bop it right now. We're that skip. was my backup one too. So you you covered both of my bases. Maybe somebody out there probably has has used to skip it while playing bop it. Do you think that's you my physically mind. possible? Oh, oh, for sure. Oh, for sure. That's a Guinness Whoever World they, Record thing. Yeah, yeah. Whoever they are, they're the most coordinated person that's ever lived. Mm-hmm. Like LeBron James, that's what how he used to train. That's it for sure. That's it. That's it. Floyd, Floyd Mayweather. People don't know the skip it, bop it training. That's how you do it. Mm. Um, okay, so uh, well, we've gotten our background on the skip it, and I'd like to hear a vote now, uh, James. If you could, lame or radical on the skip it? Radical. I think Instagram influencers would do a huge fitness trend with it, like you said. So I'm, uh, I'm totally radical. Well, I mean, we're Instagram influencers now, so yeah. uh, that's maybe true. We it's true. Yeah. We're we're going to be the trendsetters. I posted three times on Instagram today, so Ooh, yeah. look at you! Yeah, <laughs> yeah pretty big. <laughs> yeah, no, it's pretty nuts. On purpose. That's what they say about Instagram. Um, it's all about quantity <laughs> over quality. <laughs> 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 that that is the truth. None of, none of. Yeah, <laughs> not, none of the things uh, that were posted on the Working Perspectives page had, well, no, I guess they did. I did the intros for, it was 90 Seconds, 90 Day Fiance, and uh, 
the date you mm. hate. So yeah, I guess my voice is on there. So I'm hey, a fucking idiot. Hey Matt, did you notice <laughs> what that up, I uh, updated your profile on, <laughs> on uh, Working Perspectives Podcast? Your description. I hacked into Tom's on phone and did what? it for you. <laughs> I'll read it off to you. She she changed. She hacked onto my phone for free. She, <laughs> wait, on on in, on, Instagram? on Instagram now. <laughs> Our profile okay. says people pay big money for this, Matt. So you should be honored. Yeah. No I mean, one's I paying. Jill. I mean, I'm just hoping everything's grammar- gra- grammatically. Grammar- <laughs> how do you say it? Grammatically, grammatically correct? correct. Better than that, yeah. <laughs> grammatically. grammatically, yes, it's grammatically. Mm. <laughs> Martine Grammatica. Grammatically. grammatically. <laughs> uh, it says that we are a bi-coastal yep. career podcast, which is correct. Um, hosted Mm -hmm. by a man with one to four jobs at any given time, which is correct, and another with none. So, (laughs) Jesus Christ. (laughs) You have to tell people I don't have a job. Come on. Yeah. Honesty is what's going to bring us all in, Matt. Yeah. Oh my gosh. How about it? Well, I mean, Jill, uh, everything looks to be spelled correctly, so that's phenomenal. And he does have a job. He's the editor and producer of an award winning Mm -hmm. podcast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, An award winning podcast. I will say, just to follow up with my intro there, we could use an A in one spot. There is a one spelling error that I see. So, in coastal. There should be an A in coastal. Oh my! (laughs) See, (laughs) (laughs) we're by coastal. Look at us, a bunch of by coastal. How dare you? What should you be now? It's what we're here for, guys. It's really funny that you know this is this is how we know we have we have an English major on our hands because Jill wrote it. I read it the other day. I read it again, and then Matt reviewed it and said, yep, looks like there's no grammatical. (laughs) (laughs) And then Jamie looked at it once and said, oh, this isn't isn't the English language. (laughs) Yeah, yeah. Man, that's what you guys do with that. Listen, can we just go to my fucking skip it now? I I guess (laughs) being... Dress be from grammatically incorrect. I don't know. <laughs> How do you say grammatically? Gra- grammatically. 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 It's a D. Yeah. It's a it's a T. Hey, <laughs> it's a T. Hey, hey Matt. While we're on the subject of uh, of making us look bad, can we cover one more? Sure. Of course, okay. please do. Uh, so what is Matt? Fix what's it. it? What's it called when? <laughs> When you're an employee and you don't go to work in person, but you have to have a you have to have a meeting on your computer, what, what is that called? Well, like like a viral meet. Yes, but it's a virtual like a- meet. Viral. <laughs> oh. <laughs> if you're meeting virally, that's the that's the problem with COVID. You shouldn't be meeting virally. Oh man. <laughs> Golly. That's how we got in so this I, mess. Have I said that several times before, yes, you Jake? Know. Maybe is that is that but, where that's coming never from? Never on air until now. <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! Well, hey, uh, you know, I got a, I got expelled from two high schools, so you guys can go make shit. All right. Yeah, old Uncle Maddie never went to college. I'll tell you that. But, uh, okay, so either way, uh, I'm going to vote lame on your fucking <laughs> skipper, okay? <laughs> fucking bicostal, all right? Sh- Shake, Jake, can you give me your vote on the skip it? You're the tiebreaker. Oh, man. Okay. I lo- no, I Jill's going to vote, too. <laughs> yeah, Jill gets oh, Well, how are we going to do this? <laughs> I got mad at Tom well, instead of you. We need a tiebreaker <laughs> vote. All right. Penny, Penny will be oh, the tiebreaker. No. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna let Jill vote for me because we need it. We need. Excellent. What? Fuck. Fuck. Well, then I'm gonna take Jill's vote away. Mm. Fuck. Well, what? Hear you. Happy wife, happy life. Pick the answer. Well, how is, about, why it's can't not you lame. both have a vote? Is that it's not lame? It's not. Oh well, I agree with Jill, so it doesn't matter. Anyway. I, I love okay. the freaking skip. It. I <laughs> so wish I still rad. had one. If, it's rad. If it, if it's not lame, then it's rad. It's right? rad. And, 
So we got three out of four rads. And totally if, honestly, tubular. <laughs> if I wasn't beaten with one as a kid, I'd probably it's like a really it too. Cool but, yeah, the know. trauma sticks with you, Matt. Gotcha. Yeah, you know. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's uh, you know, if I wasn't so grammatically incorrect <laughs> all the time, and then you know, it was it would have been better. Okay, so moving on. Uh, Jillian, since you also are a special guest today, do you have a memory lame for us? Lame, as in lame. Um, sure, of course. That would yeah. be AIM. Oh. AOL Instant Messenger? Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh, uh, duh. Uh, oh, my God. <laughs> All right, hold on. All right, before we do anything else, before we do anything else, we need to go around one by one, and we all have to say our AOL instant messenger. Ah, oh, so good. Okay, this is a great, great so, idea. So I, I will go first. I had two of them. The first one was Word. It was W five five zeros R D. Word. <laughs> and then the second one, the second one I had was Shantae Jackson, and it was named after. The uh, little person from the movie Me, Myself, and Irene. Sean Man, Jackson, that's a deep cut. Out. So, yeah, there you go. Man, that's lovely. <laughs> hey, what are you going to do? That's how I roll. All right. All right. Yep. Jim, Jim A, your, uh, your usernames, if you please. Um, I had way too many to list them mm-hmm. all, but my first one my first one was Cheer Jam 826 um, uh, because I was a us. cheerleader. My name is Jamie, and 826 <laughs> is my birthday. No, um, no, but I would like to note that I had one in high school specifically for like prank I aming other people. Oh, very nice. Uh, so, I was a joint account, uh, Jamie. Because <laughs> it's, it's a joint account yeah. with Jill and I. So. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> I'm very proud of that. <laughs> That's really good. Mm-hmm. And what what was the what was the name? Uh, um, I don't. It was something ninja. It was something super ninja, secret. and we oh, would just yeah, something. <laughs> it was, it really was called weird. Super Secret Ninja, something like that, and we would, mm. mm-hmm. something like that. Name. I don't hate yeah, it. and we, we would can't reveal it because we still message. use it. <laughs> <laughs> we use it to yeah, message like... all the boys that I have a crush on, and like, I think oh at some God. point, like, just our friends and just mess with them. It was a ton of fun. Destine a lot of great sleepovers oh, yeah. with it. <laughs> yeah, you're sadistic. Uh, okay. Man, so very nice. Moving, moving on, uh, Jillian, Jillian Michael, Jillian Michael Byers, what was your username, if you please, besides Super Secret Ninja 27 <laughs> or whatever it was? Um, I, I really don't remember, but I do remember the, like, digits in it were... 612 because that was the birthday of a guy I liked. <laughs> Ooh, that's, that's not my birthday. Uh, Just so you know, I was born in November. So. <laughs> you know, she didn't tell me that before we got married. <laughs> you know She's for the streets, is, Tom. Yeah. You know whose birthday is 612? Who? I do. Who? His name's John. No. Bell. That's so, September 23rd. <laughs> Those uh, magic moves uh, just stuck with you. So good. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, I don't know. Whoever he you, is, we're going to find and him and shoot guys, him. Guys, let's not let Jill off the hook here. She's pretending she doesn't know her AIM. Oh, wow. <laughs> why would Jill, I know that? Come on, don't be what do you mean? Why? Don't be, we all know. We all know him. Don't be well, a you messaged me. What right? was it? Do you remember? No. <laughs> It was uh, Jill's. I, was I don't want to say the wrong one because I was AIM and a lot of ladies back huh. then. So, oh, yeah. 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 Shots fired. I don't, but I feel like I might have a memory card from a camera from high school oh, that probably has a photo with something on it. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back and ask Mama and Papa Yerk if they've got anything <laughs> that could give a hint. Okay. Jill, if you don't tell us now, we are going to blast this because we are Instagram influencers. Okay. And if you don't tell us and we find out, we will. Yeah, we're going to sick all of our, our followers on you. They're, right. they're going to yeah. find out. Dozens and dozens. I don't. Followers. That won't affect me because I don't right. follow you guys. <laughs> That's bullshit. She does. She follows. Wow. <laughs> she will after this. I can get you into her. You follow us, but you hack our account. Yeah. 
Yeah, you hack our account to to, to grammatically incorrect it. <laughs> you, you, you <laughs> right. Seek and destroy. Right, hold on, hold on. Let's let's. I know that this is a long segment, but we need to cover one more thing with AIM. Um, are we all admitting that we were at times emotional um, profile and away message people? Oh, you didn't say yes, you God. One yes. no, oh, thousand yes. percent. Oh my God, yes. Uh, oh my God, yes. Even to this day, I am the moodiest person yeah. I've ever met. Imagine me in like middle school with all those purity. Because you don't have a way to express through. yourself. You need, a, you need an away message yeah. now. Yeah. 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 Don't oh, talk true. to oh. me. <laughs> Only yeah. certain people oh. know. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. And you thought you were cool, you would put like BRB. Go shove it up your shelf with your BRB. <laughs> yeah. Or like a cryptic code. <laughs> yeah. Well, I remember one time I put R.I.P. Matt Lavelle, and I'm Matt Lavelle. Are you Man, Matt always had his followers on the on their toes. Oh man, I kept them guessing, you know. And you say you change like your your profile. Oh my god! So, so Matt put R.I.P. Matt so Lavelle, and then nobody contacted him. <laughs> <laughs> just silence radio silence from the crowd just everyone unfollowed him or whatever yeah. i guess there was no unfollow oh, wait what was it you could unfriend, unfriend. unfriending so them, them. Yeah. Yeah. man i miss am i wish it still Dude. existed that'd be sweet i'd love the sound effects yeah it's called it's called text messaging yeah i was gonna say it's like teams or like skype or something like that for adults they all, now yeah, they, all, they all got it from there for it's sure. for when you're meeting virally so <laughs> <laughs> i should mention uh, i didn't say what my youth my screen name was um, you didn't we're waiting anxiously yeah, well, for no, it no 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 what? no 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 Jillian is not getting off the hook. What I was don't it? know Come it. On, Jill. I remember telling. No, wait. I know Come it. Come on. I know it, Jane, but it was. What is it? It's personal information. It was your middle name with your last name, and then five two three. Oh, that's what yeah. it was. May race. At least when. Yeah. yeah. At least when I knew you, that's what. Yeah, it was. that actually is my still AOL email. Yeah. It was I her social security had, number. Yeah. But that's not my my crush's birthday. <laughs> that's my birthday. <laughs> no. But remember, I didn't meet you until AIM was on its way out already. Yeah, so. that's true. So I didn't. Yeah, I missed the best parts yeah. of aiming with if you. If somebody had asked me, <laughs> if someone had asked me, I would have said I didn't use AIM at all in high school, and that's totally false because this shows you how long no, you totally Gil did. and I and Jamie have been uh, friends at slash uh, spouses. Yeah. Um, <laughs> me, you, and Jamie. That's what I said. <laughs> Yeah, we're all spouses. We're all spouses. <laughs> we're basically sister wives yeah. at this point. So <laughs> Matt's on the outside looking at So he gets away with it. <laughs> well, to, actually, Shake, uh, to be fair, I remember you and me, I I am and you I am to me that Doug Glanville just hit a walk off. No way. So oh, beautiful stuff. Yep. Line drive right field coming hard. Bob uh -oh. can't get it. He uh -oh. cuts by him. Glanville's going to get at least three. He might circle him. He might circle him. That's Boots waving him on. Boots waving him on. It's an inside the park home run. Doug Glanville. An inside and I respond to what's a walk off? Oh, my God. Yeah, Jill still. <laughs> anyway. I want to. Sh that's how long um, we've all been. We've all been hanging out with each other. Is that AIM still existed when we, when yeah. we first started? Was definitely yep. a thing. But who yep. cares now? What's Solidly a thing. <laughs> yeah. All right, fine. <laughs> Jill, Jill's eighty-year-old lady with some numbers name, whatever. I remember your brother Kev's was Kevron, right? And then Shake. What was mine? Your... Was Saint Thomas of Fourth Street. Such a bad name. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> because I was oh man, I was not pretentious at all back then. So good, <laughs> definitely. No, but not. You were, hey man, dude. That's uh, probably the best saint to be of if you're going to be of any saint of anywhere. It's uh, four straight. Yeah, yeah. God, Saint Thomas the Fourth. Yeah. I got it, and I must Great say, name. the Catholic Church wow. never gave me that official distinction. Um, I'm sure. <laughs> You never I'm, sure, I'm sure they're still, you know, mulling it over at the old Vatican. 
Yeah, they're still they're still yeah. chalking it up. So they saying, just have a couple hey, people hey, in front of you in line. That's not, all. Yeah. It's no yeah. Old deal. Mama T. You know they're waiting to get mm. her done, and then they'll probably throw you in. There. Do you have a message or a story inside of you that you've been waiting to tell? Have you always dreamed of writing a book but are intimidated by the complexities of the book publishing world? Perhaps you want to use a book to launch your public speaking or consulting career. If so, please reach out to Scott and Bell Publishing, located right here in beautiful Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Scott and Bell Publishing handle all genres and authors with all experience levels. Scott and Bell Publishing gives authors 100% creative freedom and a higher royalty split. They can be found at www.skotbell.com. That's www.s is in Sam, K is in Kite, O is in October, P is in Tom, B is in Boy, E is in Edward, L is in Larry, L is in Larry.com. That's Scott and Bell Publishing, where the authors go. But, uh, For sure. Okay. All right. Nice. So, Jillian, wow, that we really went uh, bird <laughs> that was walking a good one. shake. Is that bird it? Bird walking. That's, that's the official yeah. term. Bird walking. All right. So, let's vote. Uh, Jillian, since you introduced it, what is your vote on AOL in semester? Very lame. I hated it. You, <laughs> what? Oh, God. I, we are going to fight after this. Show, I used to. Right? First, you give me bi costal, and now you're saying. <laughs> I'm sorry. I used to. Yeah, I used fight. to tell people that I had a a, a shutdown system. Oh, <laughs> yes. I never gave it to you, Jamie. So you're not familiar, but I this definitely gave it to term. Tom. Yeah. I used to tell him, "Sorry, my computer's hooked up to where it shuts down if I talk too long on the AIM," and then I would just hang up on the AIM. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god so lame well i'm glad i wasn't a victim of this lie <laughs> i would fully shut off my computer my <laughs> to ensure no That's no hassle. okay oh yeah all right good for you jill good jill. for you yeah you gotta keep those predators at bay That's i what just you prefer do. to be on okay for sure. uh, one through jamay uh lame or radical on aol and the messenger I'm going lame. It's basically uh, teams for kids, and I don't like it. Gosh. <laughs> All right, shake you. Uh, I'm going to vote rad. I think that this was like a, a revolutionary way for kids. Yes. And you have yes. to remember, this is you, I feel like you guys are voting as if you had cell phones back then, but this is pre-cell phones. I mean, come on. It was the only way yeah, for us. Yeah. No, we had Big cell time. phones. We had cell phones. I mean, eventually. I didn't, I didn't get a cell phone until I was 24. <laughs> no. I got a cell phone in 2003. I had my first cell phone in 2003. Okay. We definitely oh, had nice. AIM with cell and phones. And did your cell phone definitely have tech? Yeah. I was still house talking it up. Yes, because I, I would always get in trouble, but yes, I was able to text. I'm going to look up when AIM started. But I always went over. Well, anyway, I'm voting yeah, rad, yeah. man. It was rad. Come on, man. It was so, definitely, I think it was before that. I think It's 100% rad. I'm voting rad as well, and it was awesome, and you guys suck. Your vote sucks. <laughs> it was totally rad. So rad. Okay. Uh, Shake, is this enough for this segment? Should we move uh, on? It's up to you. What do you guys think? You want to do one more? We could, we could sneak one more in real quick. Let's fucking toss around one more real quick. Yeah, why not? Let's toss right. one more into the hopper. Hit me with your memory lame there, Shake. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to offer up this one. Uh, Goosebumps books. And the TV show. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I still watch Goosebumps on YouTube. Mm. Yep, you can still watch full episodes of Goosebumps on YouTube, which features the premiere of Ryan Gosling, by the way. So. Oh, wow. really Holy oh. smokes. <laughs> that's Shake's favorite Ryan. Uh, that's Shake's favorite easily Ryan. Easily my favorite right Ryan. There. It's the best Ryan, to be fair. Yeah. The best that's Ryan. His I'm with you. Favorite Ryan. He, he's yep. incredible. Well, don't tell yeah. that in front of Pete McCormick. That, Pete McCormick. Around, that Goosebumps yeah. uh, TV show was yeah. was actually yes. scary. I remember I used to get really scared of the books and the TV show. Yeah. But, so, okay. So, all right. Dude, I remember I never read a book in my life, but I started reading Camp, Camp something. 
It was like the Camp Terror. It was like a Goosebumps book about camp. And actually, in fourth grade, this is great. So in fourth grade, they had a thing where we were supposed to write uh, like a fan autograph to someone. And like a lot of people were picking like Emmett Smith and like, you know, whatever, mm-hmm. big like Randall Cunningham, like huge like stars. And like, you know, some girl got in trouble because she wanted to write to Madonna. You know. And they're like, you are not writing to Madonna. This is a Catholic <laughs> school and you're in fourth grade. Right. So either way, I wrote to R.L. Stein. Oh, yeah. Great. Believe it. And yeah. And he wrote back. I got a fan letter back. No it was awesome. Really? That's awesome. I'm pretty jealous. Do you still have them? Fuck no. Are you kidding me? I think I kept a letter from R.L. Stein after I got expelled from my second high school. <laughs> yeah, really? Come on. <laughs> Goosebump right. books. Um, the first ones were published in 1992. And it looks like they... Mm-hmm. I think the, the ones that we all think of as Goosebump books uh, went until 97. Yeah. So, God, dude, what a run! Yeah. Didn't he have? Uh, didn't he sell more books in that five-year period than Stephen King? Oh, I mean, I would assume so. I mean, because you have to think I don't about. Know, but I'm gonna find out now. Yeah, you should look it up because they could actually put them in school libraries. That's. I think he outsold Stephen King. I don't know, man. No one outsells yeah. the King. Yeah, you're not putting it in the library. <laughs> Be close. I wonder if I think maybe in the '90s R.L. Stein might have had him, but who knows? Stay out uh, of the okay. basement. So, here, here right. are some so titles, def- real quick. Stay out of the basement. All right, hit us, hit us. Um, say cheese yep. and die. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's Ooh, that's classic. the TV show that had Ryan Gosling. In. Ooh, great one, Ryan. That's oh, the Ryan Gosling. Baby, girl, <laughs> the Curse wow. of the Mummy. Not tomb. obsessed at all. No. Uh, okay, keep going. Let's get invisible. Uh, Night of the Living Dummy. Um, okay. The Girl Who Cried Monster is a good one. I remember that. Here, Ooh. I'm sure yeah. I avoided that one because it had the word girl in the uh, title. <laughs> um, I mean, He-Man, yeah. Woman Haters Club yeah. for Life. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, and boys didn't have cooties, Jill? Really? You still do. Yeah. <laughs> No, I guess not just I guess it's because I'm bi costal, right? Yeah. <laughs> I like that we have this rage between us. <laughs> here's here's yeah. the one that you were talking somebody was saying uh the camp one, Welcome to Camp Nightmare is what it was called. Oh, hey, that's the one. Mm-hmm. They had the best covers, the covers on the books were so too. Great. The covers yeah. of the books were so good. So good. Best covers. Yeah. Oh my god, they were awesome. That's what sold the I, books. Yeah. The cover Go yeah. Eat Worms was one. The Choose Your Own Adventure, too, yeah. was like the first time I ever encountered one of those. So that was really cool. Yeah. Mm. A Night in Terror Tower. Interesting. I remember that. That was like a really famous one. Ooh. Mm-hmm. And I, yeah. I'm not going to read them all because it's just too many. So. Oh, Revenge yeah. of the Lawn yeah. Gnomes. Yeah, I remember that. Ooh, baby. Oh, baby, baby. the Abominable Snowman yeah. in Pasadena. I remember that. <laughs> ah, that old chestnut. Okay. All right, so let's get this in then. Uh, let's vote. Uh, so, Shake, you put this one up. Uh, what do you got? Lame or rad. radical? Rad, rad all the way, for sure. Jamay? Jamay? Rad I'm, or lame? I'm going rad. Love them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Jillian May? I'm rad as well. Yeah, I'm going to round it out with a Mondo Radical. So we got a Mondo Radical right. here. Very That's good. That's what we needed, man. That's Very what we good. needed. Mondo Love Rad. To see it. A big, big, <laughs> heavy Mondo Rad. All right.